I'm going to teach you how to properly combat zombies. Now, there is a key to fighting zombies, especially with melee weapons, and that is your timing. You need to time your shots. Now, if you have a firearm, obviously, it's super easy. You just aim for the head, shoot. If not, you hit their body until they drop. The downfall to this is, one, you need ammunition to keep going, and two, once you fire, if there's more than one zombie around, you're going to track them all to your spot. However, the good thing is, say you have one zombie and you shoot him and you don't really have enough bullets to fight the rest you can leave the area all the zombies that were attracted to the gunshot will run to the source of the gun noise or this the spot of the source so you can be out of there and you'll see them all run to your your previous location but the best way is to use melee weapons in my opinion I prefer using longer ranged melee weapons such as a spear sledgehammer anything that puts a little distance between you and the zombie now I'm gonna demonstrate how to use the spear well, the timing it with the spear and the timing it with the knife. The longer range is way better because it gives you obviously more space. Now you have to time right. Now you're not going to get it right all the time because you just you know that doesn't have work. Not how it works. So I'm hoping. Come on, come on, see me. I'm trying to aggro this guy. Okay, so let's see if I can do this right. Uh, he's running. Nope, I missed him. Alright. Okay, so, so you, got, you, you just gotta time it right. Hit him. Back up. Hit him again. Hit him again. Now he's down. Then you just finish him off. Oh. Well, you normally finish him off when he's on the ground, but he's a big bastard. All right, he is dead. So as you can see, when I was attacking him, I was swinging, moving back, swinging, moving back. Sometimes you get a little antsy, and as you can see, I did, I did this myself. As I hit him, I was like, okay, maybe I can get one more, and you can't. Most of the time, you can't, especially with the longer range. So your best bet is just to hit him, back up. If you don't feel comfortable with swinging next, let them swing first, and then just swing while you're backing up, and then as it's about to come down, move forward, and you can hit him. Let me patch up real quick. And then we'll move on to the short range. And we're going to target that guy down there because I don't want to fight three with a melee. That just doesn't work. Alright, so let's just move back here. Take out my knife. Now, as I said before, using a shorter range melee is a little bit more of a pain in the ass because you do got to get right in their face. However, you can swing quicker, so if you can time it right, you can kind of swing, back up swing before they even know what's going on. So we're going to try to, we're going to try to time this right. I'm not 100% sure. Right, he's going to run. Come on. Come at me. Swing. I right, say so you got to swing. Hit him. Back up. Hit him again. Oh. 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 oh little bop weave. <laughs> When he's on the ground, you just finish him. Oh, come on. I was out of, like, I was out of range, man. There you go. Stab you again. Alright, so as you can see, obviously I messed up my timing once or twice there. But I was able to swing quicker so you could get more hits in. But you need to hit them more. So depending on what you want. Do you want to swing a little quicker? Hit them a little more? You could do so. Or if you, you know, want to swing them a little less but you've got it more timing is required for a longer range melee my like I said my opinion I would prefer using a little bit of a longer range melee just because it's putting a little more distance it's a harder hitting does more damage but if you mess up your timing you're likely to get hit a little more so it depends it's really your play style but the key to any melee weapon is your timing so remember you just want to hit them back up hit them and just keep repeating that until they're dead once they're on the ground try to get on top of them quick and hit them because you can kind of finish them off real quick as you see the other dude he took a little bit more he got up but that's it guys it's really simple make sure like i said just watch your timing but with that this video is over i hope it was informational for you guys you know something just to help you especially beginners out there don't forget to give it a thumbs up, like it, share it, comment down below, what, tell me what you thought. You know, if this would help you if you were playing the game, if you have a different technique, let me know.